TCP provide all the services thanks to its header. As we mentioned before, the header is a overhead data that is added to the payload. Let's zoom in to explain each field in the header. Port numbers are used to identify sending and receiving applications on different hosts. A port number is a 16 bits unsigned integer. The source port identifies the sending port, which can be a random number. The destination port is used to route packets on a server to the appropriate network application. For example, port 80 is the standard port number for HTTP. The sequence number is 32 bit size. If the scene flag is set, then this is the initial sequence number. If the scene flag is clear, then this is the sequence number of the first data byte. The acknowledgement number is 32 bit size. It represents the next sequence number that the receiver is expecting. The value acknowledges receipt of all prior bytes. The header length is 4 bit size, and it specifies the size of the TCP header. The reserved field is 6 bit size. For future use, TCP holds 6 bits of different flags. URG, urgent pointer field is significant. ACK, acknowledgement field is significant. PSA, use the push function. RST, reset the connection. SYN, synchronize sequence numbers. It used only during connection establishment. FIN, indicate that there is no more data to be sent. The window field is the size of 16 bits. It specifies the current receiver's buffer size in bytes. The checksum is also 16 bits and it's used for error checking. Urgent pointer is 16 bit size. It specifies the offset from the sequence number indicating the last urgent data byte. The option has a variable size. It allows TCP to include additional options in the header.